fueled by record warm waters. Hurricane Barrels, the earliest Category 5 storm ever to form in the Atlantic. And it could be just the beginning, setting the tone for a very dangerous hurricane season. Fox Weather's Max Gordon takes a look. Hurricane Barrel traveling through the open waters of the Caribbean Sea. Take a look at images of it from the International Space Station. It looks menacing, but forecasters at the National Hurricane Center predict Barrel will start losing some intensity. Regardless, the storm is expected to remain a powerful hurricane through the week, and it's on a path towards Jamaica. Fishermen there are busy pulling their boats offshore. Residents say they are used to preparing for hurricanes. You know, I've done preparation before. There is effort that is being made for persons to, you know, leave early and do any last minute preparation that needs to be done. In St. Vincent and the Grenadines, residents are dealing with damage in Barrel's Wake. And all around me, there were houses in the village. Um, their roofs were flying past. You could see it passing. Um, it, was, it, was, it was just a, a terrifying experience. There, Barrel knocked down power lines and destroyed banana plantations. Residents say they're not used to this big of a hurricane. I don't think there's anybody on the island or even in the Grenadines who can say that they haven't been affected in one way or the other by this storm. People from the nearby island of Grenada doing what they can, loading essential supplies into a boat headed for the island of Karakou, which was hit hard by Barrel. Officials with the World Meteorological Organization worry about the cleanup and recovery efforts. It only takes one landfalling hurricane um, to set back, you know, decades of, of development. We fear that, you know, this is going to have a major knock on socioeconomic development. Barrel is expected to pass near Jamaica Wednesday, the Cayman Islands Thursday, and Mexico on Friday. In Los Angeles, Max Gordon, Fox Weather.